Yo, what's going on YouTube? Welcome back everyone to another live stream with Boulder Bomb. Hope you guys out there in YouTube land all having a great day today, wherever you are in the world. Thank you all for tuning on into my live stream and showing your support. Really means a lot to me, especially through these hard times, coming up to Christmas and all that sort of stuff. Uh, yeah, just, yeah, you guys know what's going on. I don't need to explain it all. Um, but yeah, we're just waiting now for the uh, launch of Cyberpunk on PC. So we can uh, do the download. I don't know how long the download is going to take. Hopefully it's only a small download. It won't take us too long. Here we go. Might have to restart Steam. This usually always happens when we um, have a launch. Okay, while we're waiting, let's... A bit of music in the background. I'll restart Steam. And do several things here at once. Uh, where's my Spotify widget? There you go. So it's a fifty seven gigabyte download. It's going to take us an hour. Oh, not an hour. It's going to take us. Oh, wait. We'll see. I haven't got the best download speeds. Oh, no. We've got 53 out of 57. So it's only doing a couple of gigabytes. That's all right. Anyway, I'll have a quick look at the chat. What have we got going on the chat? Yo, what's going on, Reese? Thanks for the like. Thanks, LT Viper and Massacre. Hope you guys are doing well. Thank you all for tuning on in. Thank you for the likes. No, it's only um, three gigabytes. I thought it was uh, 50 gigabytes, but it's not. We've already downloaded 54. 54 out of 57. Yeah, it's pretty pretty quick speeds at the moment. Six megabytes. It's, that's about average for me, though. Why is that not updating? There it is. Get out of the way. Shoot, what we might do while we're waiting for that. It's gone. Test of a person's true value. Death. Facing it. Staring it down. Johnny. I got you. Pressure's tanking. It's neurogenic shock. He's dying. B, you in there? Ah, my head. So what now? You find out what it is you need to do. The thing of beauty, I know. You've never backed down from anything in your life. Even when you maybe should have. You go through Night City knowing a stray bullet could end you while hailing a cab. But that's never stopped you from taking action. I believe you cheated death. It 
his death that has treated you. If you gotta kill, kill. If you gotta burn it all to the ground, then let it burn. Kill me! On the ground, asshole! Don't move! Out of my house! No! Rather live in peace as Mr. Nobody, or go down for all time in a blaze of glory. Well, that's just the launch trailer. There, that was pretty. That looked pretty sick, actually. That's and to be honest, that's actually the first thing I've actually seen in the game. I've been. Uh, Deliberately staying away from any spoilers and any early streams because people have been playing it on um, on Soul since uh, 10 p.m. last night my time. So for about the last 12 hours, people have actually been playing it already. And the embargo for the um, streaming was lifted at uh, 3 a.m. Uh, what was it? 3 a.m. CET, Central European time. So yeah, people have been able to stream it and that. But yeah, PC released just a few minutes ago, so we're going to be checking out very shortly. Uh, yo, what's going on? Dragons, Dragons Army in here. Uh, yo, what's going on, Bird? It's finally here, it certainly is here. What role have I picked? I haven't picked any role yet, because we actually haven't started. That was, like I said, that was just the launch trailer. And Massacre wants to know how much was that piece of shit. Um, what is it? Uh, let's go over to the store page. I can show you on Steam what it is in, in Australian dollars. Sorry, but you're not permitted to view these materials at this time. Why not? I'm an adult. There we go. Alright, available now. Right, well, let's click on the store. Alright. Try um we'll try GOG then. There you go. Cyberpunk. So you can get it on Galaxy of Gamers. It's the same price on Steam, I think. For eighty nine ninety five Australian. Oh, here it is here here, eighty nine ninety five Australian on Steam. So whatever it is, convert that to your currency, and then you'll um. That's how much it'll cost in your country. Yo, thanks, Hades. So we should be jumping in here very shortly. Five minutes to go now. I'm not. Uh, I'm not watching YouTube or anything. I'm making wool socks. Should I need something for you? Um, it's coming into summer here, so you can knit me a um, a woolen singlet. <laughs> yeah, that looks um, that was insane. That um, that 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 trailer that looked really cool. And yeah, I haven't picked a um, what would you call, uh, what, uh, a time uh, yeah, a timeline yet, I suppose. So I'm I'm thinking we'll go straight, kids, start off because I want to I want to sort of want to start in Night City and explore a bit of Night City, but um. I was also looking at uh, reading. I wasn't looking. Wasn't watching anything. I was reading some of the um, some of the info about it. And nomads look pretty cool too. Uh, let's see. a couple more minutes. Nearly done. Three minutes to go. Yeah, thanks everyone for tuning on in. Make sure if you're new to the channel, make sure you hit that subscribe button. And the bell so you get notified when you hit the bell make sure you tick it to all so you get notified because uh, youtube has been playing up a lot lately and not showing notifications of when people go live so if you want to stay up to date with what i'm up to what i'm doing uh, yeah make sure you subscribe all that kind of stuff hit the like if you dislike hit the dislike either way a rating helps the channel all the same so thank you everyone for all the help much appreciated
And if you want to go the extra mile and be a, an extra champ, you can hit up the links down below and help out with a donation. Everything at the at the moment is greatly appreciated, especially as I'm um, yeah I'm I'm actually starting to struggle a little bit financially. I'm going to be all right for a few months, but then um, yeah, I need to actually get off my ass and uh, get some work, find some find some paying work. Still top dono? I know mass top dono. I don't think anyone will ever top that mass. I appreciate it though. It's helped me out. It really did help me out. I actually went and raided my um. What do you call it? My uh, PayPal account in the day. <laughs> I forgot. I forgot all about it. I was like, that's right. I got PayPal. All right, one minute, 25 seconds. I'm going to go and have a quick toilet break because I've drunk a lot of coffee this morning in preparation for this. So it's gone through me. My bladder's turned into a bloody um, coffee filter, and I'll be right back. Alrighty, I'm back. Sorry about that. You know how it is when nature calls. And we don't want to be playing this on a full bladder. Uh, right. Why can we not play it now? This game is not yet released. It will be unlocked and available to play on its official release date. Okay, let's... Let's restart Steam again. This usually happens. Ryan Wheeler, this is awesome. Yeah, no, it's, it's getting there. Same as me. Looks like I'm not the only one then. Uh, here we go. Oh, what have we got? We've got some deals. Partisans, 1941. Amnesia. Survivalist, nothing of interest. All right, so just re restart your um your your Steam there. 
Hey, thanks, Dragons, with the $10 dono. Much appreciated. Thank you very much. Put that in the kitty and make sure it uh, goes to a good use. Probably use it to feed the dog or something like that. Same as me, you have to keep restarting Steam. Oh, yeah, it's... Uh... Here we go. Look, we got 60... Cause the, but the game's... On PS5, I know it's like 103 or 104 gigabytes. We've only got 60 gigabytes here on, um, on PC, so... Are we going to have to keep restarting it, downloading it, and restarting it now? Anyway, I'm only getting the green line also. I wonder why that is. Let me quickly open up another window over here. Uh, um, Cyberpunk. Uh, Steam. Release. From Australia. Uh, 11 a.m. AEST on Thursday, 10th of December, but considering the game is a whopping 70 gigabytes, developers are allowing players to pre-download the game 10 p.m. Monday, 7 December. 70 gigabytes. We've got a bit to go yet. All right. In that case, um, what can we do while we wait? Well, I will... Um, that's more music up because it's a bit quiet. We need some more music. And my widget's closed itself down again. Where's that gone? Sorry for the delay guys, it wouldn't be a normal stream if we didn't have some sort of technical difficulties. But bear with us, we'll be in playing in no time, hopefully. And I can imagine everyone's trying to jump on now and download it as well. You don't have time remaining. It's unpacking. It's, I think it's unpacking. It's what. It's a bit different the way they downloads work on computer than they do on the consoles. Shut that. Buy a cupcake or beer or something fun. Sure, it isn't much. You're highly talked about to play. That's a mon monstrosity. Yeah, what a monstrosity. <laughs> Where is Reese? He was here earlier. I don't really have any other sort of cyberpunkish games. I've got Disco Elysium. That's um, a little bit cyberpunkerish it's gonna work uh, what else have I got installed oh, Stanley Parable that's something we could play for a few minutes while we're waiting if we have to wait No worries, Mass. Take it easy, man. Don't do anything I wouldn't do. Let's see what's going on in the discussion board. Waiting. 
Guys, I think we killed Steam. Oh, that could be a thing. I think that because we all tried to download the day one update at once, Steam servers are dead. Right now it says I have 5-7 hours remaining of download. Anyone else? Or is it just me? How many people are waiting here finally to play the game? Just curious on how many people actually use the community before the launch of a big game. Just, just say anything. I am because... Steam is killed, yep, Steam is dead. Uh, am I excited for this? Um, it's... Like I said earlier on, I, I've been avoiding sort of anything, haven't been watching anything, just so I can get my own um, first-hand impressions. Saying that, there has, it's, it's been... Um, it's been widely publicised all over TV and stuff like that, and yeah, it's one of the um, most highly anticipated games of the year. So yeah, I, I am looking forward to it. But I'm one of those one of those people. As soon as someone starts talking about it or says anything, I just sort of uh, I'm like I shut my ears and I just think on happy thoughts. Yeah, I hope it lives up to everyone's hype. But end of the day, it's just another video game. It has been uh, delayed a couple of times, so let's hope that the delays are worth it. I don't know what it's doing. It's unpacking or something. Very, very glad to catch me live. Yeah, no, it's good that I can um, actually go live this time of day. And I should be able to do it a bit more over the next um, couple of months. Have a few daytime sessions. As they say, every cloud has a silver lining. So, you know, I may, I may have uh, gone through a bit of a bit of a loss the last, um, last month. But yeah, every, like I said, every cloud has a silver lining, so gotta try and find the positives where you can. This game is hyped a lot. Shake my head. <laughs> Thanks, Stopcat. Yep, yeah, we've we've um, all the PC users are broken Steam. We can't actually get in at the moment. I don't know if it's actually doing anything. Yours is stuck at 54.11 gig. Oh, so you're trying to download it too. It's Stopcat's fault. <laughs> you going live too, Stop? Because I'll um, give you a like if you are. And everyone else who's watching the stream, make sure you go and check out Stopcat. He plays a lot of different games on PC and PlayStation 4. Yo, Johnny. Is it doing anything? It's not. It's like it's frozen again. The green bar means that it's reading, so it's trying to find space to put it on your PC. I will download after the blue has reached the end. Yeah, it will down. Yeah, so that we, once the green, um, when you get to the green, that means it's unpacking basically. You've downloaded all the, uh, all the stuff. You start a stop cut. Yeah, I saw my move just a little bit then too. The sixty gigabytes compared to, um. 100 and what, 102 on PS5? I'm pretty sure I have space on my... I do, I should, I should do. 
F drive's full. Uh, I'm bring it on here. There it is. Where's my toenail gone? <laughs> I've done that. I've stubbed my toe and knocked, knocked my big toenail off. It hurts. This game is making your PC run slow. What the fuck? How, how, my, uh, how much? How many gigabytes have you got stubbed? I got um, 32 in my in my PC, running at um, 3200 megahertz. If you got more, you should. If you got at least 16, you should be right. Here we go. 25 minutes. Time remaining. Time is going again. Yay! Porn files. That's, they're on my other PC. That's um. This is all games. So we've got Assassin's Creed, so all my Steam games are on this one. And then this one's just games as well. This was just going to be like my flight sims and space sims, but I'm running out of rooms, I need another hard drive. You mean hard? No, you're um, um, not. No, nah, what do you call it? You're 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 RAM. I was just uh, I was checking my my um, how much disc 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 space I had. Oh, Saiyan's playing it on the um, PS4 Pro. Nice. Oh, it's yeah, it's it. I'm, um, I'm surprised I've got as many people watching at the moment as I do. Thank you, everyone, for tuning on in. Because, yeah, there's a lot of people playing it. If you go look over on Twitch, too, in particular, it is really busy over on there. Better give Saiyan a quick like. I don't want to watch though because it's uh, gonna ruin it. Looks good on the PS4 Pro. Anyway, I'm not going to watch. We are uh, chewing up space. Oh, I just got a message too about I'm trying to sell a graphics card, so I just want to... You streaming this on Saturday? No worries, stuff. I'll come over and check it on out if I'm not um, busy watching myself. Here we go, five minutes. Maybe I should shut down some of these. Um, I don't need that one going. There we go, smoke. Yeah, I'm surprised you, that's why I asked you yesterday, Mass, I was like, are you getting it, Mass? And you were like, nah, I'm not buying that piece of shit. Dragons was like, nah, I'm waiting for it to go multiplayer. I don't think it'll ever go multiplayer. Um, yeah, it looks really good in terms of single, single player. 
Oh, your brother got it stopped. Nice one. Yeah, it's always good when you can you can do that. Share your accounts and stuff. I mean, you can just straight out um, gift games to people on Steam. But when you buy when you buy games, you can buy them for yourself, but you can also buy them for your friends. If you, you know, want to get a multiplayer game, you think, oh, I got a mate who wants to play that too. I'll buy it for him as a gift. Counter Strike. Death Stranding. Yeah, I'm never really in, into that. Witcher 3. Can't wait to watch the one of the Canadian to play it. <laughs> Been updated lately. Hell Let Loose. That's a good game. I want to stream a bit of that. Oh, has he got it? Oh, nice. I've got a mate who's finally got it. Cool. Available now. Yeah, it's available, but we actually can't play it. Three minutes. Come on. And then it just has to unpack as well, because... The last few gigabytes are going to be zipped up. <laughs> That's it. I'm a wannabe Canadian. If I couldn't live in Australia and had to choose somewhere else to live, I'd probably choose Canada, I reckon. And then New Zealand. Yours is another hour? Damn. Um... Well, I'm hardwired on on my into my router with Ethernet, so and I'm not using anything else at the moment. I'm just um, streaming and downloading this, so that's all I'm doing on my internet. Turn everything else off. Oh, didn't you do the? Did you pre-download it? Because you could download it on the seventh. Yo, thanks, Snow. Oh, you, yeah, you must have got the same thing as I got the, um, what do you call it, the, the day one patch. As people, uh, as people are downloading it, the servers should speed up. I'm on the Australian server, so, um, it shouldn't affect, my download won't affect your region. Fingers crossed, toes crossed, everything crossed. Let's hope that it works. We don't have to do any more downloads now. All right, I'll turn the music off. Uh, is the stream buffering? Um, maybe try and refresh. Yeah, don't forget you are downloading as well at the same time. So watching watching this will be eating into your um your download bandwidth. Uh, that.
updating tickets. Ah, uh, what's this? So we've got a little launch. So this is my rewards. What, what, what have I got here? Your rewards will be waiting for you in the stash located in V's apartment. Uh, because, because I got it through GOG. Um, because I've got my Steam account connected to my GOG account. I think that's why. Uh, digital goodies included with every physical or digital copy of Cyberpunk. So we get a wolf. Wolf School Jacket, Galaxy T-Shirt, Wolf School T-Shirt, Black Unicorn, and a Shoop, Shoopy the Troll plushie. And then if you have Gwent the Witcher card game, you also get Breathtaking Title, Samurai Coin, Samurai Card Back. Anyway. Let's play. Not here to look like crap. Let's play some cyberpunk. Uh, what's my mouse doing? I can't use my mouse. Yeah, you can ask me a question, Daniel. Of course you can. I may not know the answer, though. Let me know if it's too loud or too quiet for you guys. Breaching. Uh, oh, put that one up. Turn that one down a little bit. There we go. What was the last time since we last spoke? Yeah, if you want to, man. Yeah, I should be. Um, what's tomorrow? Friday. I'm around. I should be here. Uh, to make Cyberpunk 2077 and its future expansions and content as good as possible, we'd like to ask you your permission to collect and process your analytics data, including error reports, general gameplay statistics. Your data is sent automatically via the internet. Um, yeah, I'll give him my, I'll, I've got nothing to hide from him. Uh, first thing we need to do, settings. Nudity sensor. Unfortunately, we've got to turn that on because of. Uh... That's loud, isn't it? Is it loud for you guys? So, did they save? Yeah, cool. So, easy, the right choice for players who just want to sit back and enjoy the story. Combat will not pose a challenge. 
enemies will have all the tools at their disposal to take V on, but primarily only enemies at a higher level will prove a challenge. Looks like it's uh, set to hard already. Combat will be a substantial challenge. The effective use of perks, cyberware, combat gadgets, and consumables will be essential forces of survival. And a very hard buckle up for a serious challenge. Careful character development and clever use of items, game mechanics, and the environment will be necessary to help V make it on the streets of Night City. Um, we'll start on normal. If it's too easy, we'll go up. If it's too hard, we'll go down. So we've got Nomad Street, Kid, and Corpo. And the gameplay I saw was a little bit of it was um, Nomad, and I thought, yeah, that's right. Like I said, we want to start exploring um, Night City early on. Yeah, what does it say down below? I'll read the little blurbs. Roaming the Badlands, looting scrapyards, raiding fuel depots. Life on the road wasn't easy, but growing up in a nomad clan has its perks. Honesty, integrity, and a love of freedom. Qualities that few in Night City possess, and no amount of money can buy. Uh, street kids. They say if you want to understand the streets, you've got to live them. Gangs, fixers, dolls, small-time pushers, you are raised by them all. Down here, the law of the jungle dictates the weak serve the strong the only law in night city you have yet to break and for corpo few leave the corporate world with their lives few are still with their souls intact you've been there you've bent the rules exploited secrets and weaponized information there's no such thing as a fair game only winners and losers i like the sound of that one um but yeah, we're gonna go straight kids for now there's our life path yo gossip best and male or female? Let's go female. It's in first person, but it doesn't really matter. So we've got, got some presets here. What's that one? That looks interesting. I'm V. Oh. I'm V. I'm V. I'm V. There's already a bit of customization that we can uh, pick from. Look at that. It's still only the char character select on the hair. Why ruin it with first person? <laughs> no worries, Massacre. Have a good one. Guarantee there'll be um, people will come out with mods and stuff like that for later on for third person and whatnot. Don't mind that sort of hairstyle. All right, it'll do. A whole bunch of presets to go through, and then you can. Obviously, select what you want from here as well. changing
cyberware. Facial tattoos. <laughs> Where's race when you need him? Body determines your raw physical power in addition to allowing you to force open doors. Each level of body starting from level 3 will add 5 health points, add 3 stamina points, increase damage with fists and gorilla arms by 3, increase damage with melee weapons by 1.5%, decrease movement penalty while grabbing an enemy and wielding an HMG by 6%, increase movement while grappling an enemy and enemy grapple duration by 5 seconds. Love how much you can customize and they ruin it by letting by letting you see yourself. Yeah, I don't know what. We'll, we'll, we'll see. Um, okay, let's. We'll start off. So you can. We've got six points available. Full determines your resilience, composure, and effectiveness in operating from stealth. Each level of cool will increase crit damage by two percent, increase all resistance by one percent. Increase stealth damage by 10%, reduce the speed at which enemies detect you in stealth by 0.5%, increase mono wire damage by 3. Technical ability represents your technical know-how. It allows you to unlock doors and use tech weapons. Each increase in level will increase your armor by 5%. Reflexes determine your maneuverability in addition to increasing your overall movement speed. Each level in reflexes will increase your passive evasion from enemy attacks by 1%, increase crit chance by 1%, increase damage from mantis blades by 3%. Now intelligence determines your net running proficiency. Every level of intelligence will increase cyber deck ram capacity by 4%. Increase quick hack damage by 0.5%, increase quick hack duration by 1%. But can you see your feet? Actually, a good point. We don't know yet. We'll um we'll find out in a minute. Five intelligence, five technical. Yeah, I think that's pretty well rounded. Biomonitor panel initializing. The backstory, yeah, it's us. Shit. 
should, um, when I get a chance, we'll have a look at the graphics options and that too. Should have done that first. I'm looking at the other screen, looking at all my bloody performance stats. And you can see your hands. Anyway, I'll try not to talk through any of the cutscenes and stuff like that. Some bastard tried to mug me. I handled it. Oh, local guy. You really think somebody local tried to mug me, Pepe? Listen, V. I got a problem. Serious this time. It's a uh, cork. I owe him. Don't pay by tomorrow, said he'd bust my legs. He don't joke about that stuff. Got cartels in his corner. You in it with Kirk? Every man, woman, and rat in Haywood knows he's a fucking shark. My bro jumped the joint. Deserve the hero's welcome. I know I fuck up. I'll talk to Kirk, but then you're gonna owe me one. Welcome to Cyberpunk 2077. First time in Night City? Pay close attention to the tutorials to learn more about the basic mechanics of the game. Or if you're already an experienced Edge Runner, feel free to disable hints. Go to database at any time during the game to access tutorials as well as to read up on the most important topics of Cyberpunk 2077. So You're saving my life, Vee. Truly. Alright, I'll have a quick look at the um, graphics settings. Let's. Can we. Have we got custom? We do. Let's go for. Go for Ultra. And then we can turn some stuff down as well. Depth of field and motion blur off. Contact shadows. Because with ray tracing, it seems to set it just to ray tracing. It what was it? Ray tracing ultra. Um, seems like I can handle it with this graphics card. It just doesn't seem to be. I'll see if it goes. I want mesh quality. Turn the shadows down, that'll um, increase your frames. Cascade shadow range. I'll have to come back later on and have a. How far you can see shadows cast by the sun. I'll leave that one on high. Quality of meshes used for casting shadows corresponds to the consistency between the shadow and the light source. There's a whole bunch of stuff you can change though. Um, ambient illusion, let's turn that off. Ray tracing is off. I wonder how it runs with DLSS. What have we got? Auto. Performance, ultra performance. Leave that off for now. Just turn that ray tracing off. I already noticed a big difference in the in the frames. One thing else I want to do though. I got. Mighty. Exactly. He was too 
bottles of scents on short last delivery. No, no, that ain't possible. Uh, still... oh, I was at the hospital today. Javi's got some broken ribs, but praise Jesus, the bullet didn't hit any organs. What happened? A police manhunt. They were chasing some dealers. So he had it coming, eh? He was just standing there. Standing, understand? NCPD people shoot it everywhere. He don't deal, never has. Hey, Kirk. Wanna talk? V, been a while? Spin it, what you need? Pepe asked me to talk you up. What, he too shot a hand over the Yetis himself? Uh, tell him I don't fight. Not yet. Cut him some slack, will ya? He'll pay. Just needs some more time. Do I look like a priest that runs a charity to you? You borrow Eddie's, you gotta pay him back. With interest. It's common fucking knowledge. You suggesting I let a flaky cunt who can't keep a deal off the hook? No. You let him off because it's me asking. Huh. You know me. I'm a man of the bids. So I need to know what I get out of it. You know what, Kirk? I sometimes get the impression you forget you aren't from around here. Pop into Haywood for the occasional visit, sure. But you live far, far away in Pacifica. What are you getting at? Getting at? You probably need to think before you start something with a local son. Hmm. I'm open to other options. What's this? Grab a look. Mm-hmm. Cream ride there on the page. Only four of them in NC as of now. One, Rayfield Regional Director. Two, Mayor Ryan. Three, a rental service. Uh-huh, and four? Number four will belong to my client. Just as soon as you clep it for me, that is. I do this, and Pepe's debt is squared. Of course. I'm a man of my word. You know that. Whole thing simple. You swipe the Rayfield for me, I clear Pepe's account. Even toss in a cut for you, I'm such a nice guy. My man Rick works a parking structure by Embers, a club where our Rayfield driver likes to kick it. There every Friday night, like clockwork. As soon as you appear, security cam shut down, gate swings up, the road is yours. Just gotta grab the Rayfield and roll out. Simple. How am I supposed to do this? Expect me to slide under the chassis on a skateboard for a quick hot wire? Fast and easy? Kirk, wheels like this got security systems. Good ones. This bitty bop works like the key Rayfield Techs use for repairs. Opens locks, bypasses identity authorization. A skeleton key for all Rayfields in the city. Oh, come on, Kirk. Even you don't buy that. Kabuki's tech wizards sell more magical shit than this under the counter. Have a little faith. So, we all agreed then. Best keep your word, Kirk. Easy, V. Job's gonna pad your wallet too, you know? Head to Ember's in the Glen. Rick's in the garage. Be waiting for you. You two will hit it off. Active jobs are marked with exclamation on the mirror. Is that a big belly? Yeah, he likes his burgers, that boy, doesn't he? Didn't finish your burger, mate. Is this a vending machine?
Alice, Ryan, suits in the same circle. Let me see your You can't see your feet. Got back from Atlanta a few weeks ago. See, you got a good down home welcome. How was it, Baptiste? Tell you later. Got something on my How head. about you fill me in now? We'll give you a ride. Marcus, let's go. You mean I'll give you a ride? No? I have to get in, okay. So where to? The Glen. Drop me off at Embers. Front door? Take the ramp back of the bar. Show you where to stop. You heard of Marcus. Your return to NC has been good. Busy already. Two years gone by. Not much has changed. You know Haywood. It has strong roots. Ever watered by the same blood. Now, tell me about you. I'll pick up something here and there. Nothing major. But I'm getting by. Appreciate the concern. So, Atlanta didn't turn out like you expected, huh? Went there without expectations, actually. Well, except that it'd be better than here. It wasn't. Maybe it'll all work out for the best. Shit. Stop the car. What's going on? Business. You carry it? Sebastian Ibarra. Looks like it's my lucky day. What do you want? To settle our biz once and for all. Got an offer for you, Patty, so listen up. Get the fuck out of Vista. Pull your boys off the street. I'll give you the Glen. Done deal. No more restless nights. See how generous I can be? Well, Patty. One What's more gonna... fucking word. Stay out of this. I don't know you. And I don't know you, which means you're worth shit around here and capable of even less. Well, anything else? It seems our conversation has come to a close. <laughs> Careful, Padre. You never know who's got a barrel at your six. You neither, shit bucket. Oh, look at Marcus, please. Pleased to see you have not forgotten me. Still have me. So many of the little shits left around here. Their spines go soft when they look down a barrel. Who is that? 
No one important. He'll be gone in a week's time. Another will come in his place. He pulled iron on you. He did. And he will pay for doing so. Pull up here. Right here. I'll just strap down below. Here, before you go. Your number? Could be useful. Maybe we can also work together again. Take ourselves back two years. Thanks, Padre. Gotta go. So go with God. Or I'll be damned. So I got a bit of crafting as well. So upgrades as well. So your clothing and that's basically your armor, okay? I like, like the way that works. V? Status. On location. About to find your man. Rick's one of the good guys, you'll see. I trust him like a brother. piece of wonder tech for a world you're a woman of little faith see we're rich now fire her up and call me when you're underway I'll tell you where to go hmm. looks like this will be a cool breeze Inspector, 
Spit it out. Yeah, I'll wait. Like that. The pig that chatters. Left for Atlanta, looking for a slice of happiness. Guess you didn't find it. I've always maintained it's the same for all you termites in Haywood. Born here, live here, die here. Looks like I was right. Rat got your tongue? You know fuck all about me. Truth hurts, huh? Just watch your tongue. I'm not a patient man. Come on, Stance. Give us a break, huh? You lock us up, I just jerk off till trial. And then what? <coughs> Worst case, we get some months. Hell, standing room only nowadays in El Bote. Oh, they'll probably be out early. Are these the thieves? Fuck oh, ordinary dear. street trash. Got him in custody, Mr. Fujioka. We'll be taking them now. It's a waste of effort. I have no time to testify or play it on an investigation. Suggesting we let them go, sir? I suggest you toss them in the sea. Cuff legs broken so this trash doesn't flow. Damn. You heard him. <sighs> Fuck. A pair of concrete boots for us. Welcome to Night City. Motherfucker. Honestly, for a sec there, things looked iffy. Wasn't sure we'd worm out of that alive. Man, same. Stunts is out to get people, wound tight. Though he does have a little honor left. Really think his sense of honor saved us? Well. And the fact he's Haywood born and bred like us. If I hadn't come, you'd be cruising Night City in sexy wheels right now. Nah, it was all my fault. Wait, what? Pigs didn't waddle in out of nowhere. My tech must have triggered the alarm. So, maybe now, as God ordained. Jackie Wells. V. I know you. You hang at the Coyote. Wait, Wells? Like, Mama Wells? Thought I recognized the name. She's my blood, all right. Coyote's her dive. It's strange you and I never met before. Got the job to steal those wheels, said the coyote. From Kirk. You work with that sewer slug? Pepe owes him big, and can't afford to pay, so I stepped up. Man, gotta wonder about Pepe letting slimy Kirk boss him around like that. Heard what they say. He's backed by cartels. Cartels? No, no, listen. I know those cartel types, and I guarantee you, none of them have even heard of Kirk. El cabrón's gotta learn. You don't do people in Haywood dirty. Come on, let's go have some lunch. Lunch? <laughs> you would not believe my mama's chili. Best in town. Getting one of my good feelings. About what? About us. Sets a kind of chemistry, you know? Come on. I'm fucking starved. Okay, food it is. Let's go. Hello there, Night City! Stanley here with you, and we got another day ahead of us in this city of dreams. Ooh, I love this town. Love it like you might love a mother who popped you out on the steps of an orphanage once and now stops you to ask if you got a smoke for her. <laughs> but only half these gods will survive a year, and that's if it's a good one. And why do these peeps come to NC? Well, to be street samurai like Morgan, Black Hand, and Wayland Boa Boa. The greater the risk, the bigger the bounty, kids. Or so they say. But you can only be a major league player for so long. The faster you 
Thought it was only lunch. This is just lunch. I had to see what they do for dinner. Insane. Yo, what's going on, Keegan? Chick we're looking for is somewhere in this building. Probably crawling with the pendejos that kidnapped her. Eyes and ears open. Half a year later. That was a long lunch. Speaking of which, got you a little something. Militech training shard. In case you need to uh, brush up on your dance moves. Down for some target practice in VR? Sure. Why the hell not? What's this futuristic video gaming? Let's begin with basic combat training. This session will be recorded for subsequent evaluation. This course is designed to reinforce your fundamental combat abilities and hone your reflexes. The skills you gain here will help you survive, even excel on the battlefield. I will train you to be effective with firearms, to use stealth tactics to your advantage, and to hack into enemy networks. Because app Militech... Man, Militech can't encrypt for shit. But they clearly got drilling jarheads in their blood. Now, station one, you maggot! Move, move, move! Let's blast through a tactical target practice program. You know, a little warm up. Yeah, I didn't think you'd find that too tough. What do you say we crank it up a notch? Not bad. But it's more realistic if the target's packing iron. Quit standing around and take cover. Press C to crouch and hide from behind cover. Cover can protect you from enemy fire. Installing Cyberpunk 2077. Oh, nice one. You took a hit. Use a reanimator to patch yourself up. Head to the training area when you're good to go. Oh, look. Brought some tombs with him this time. You know what to do here. Platform and we'll move on. Hacking's the next item on the menu. Might notice I tweaked the course material a bit. Open your scanner. This training module will teach you how to apply techno- Work a little hack magic on the screen to distract the guard. No worries. Try again. 
Yo, what's going on, Ron Wheeler? How you doing? Watch the window. Work a little hack magic on the screen to distract the guard. Over substance. Good. Now take him out quietly. All right, all yours. Take him out. Never smart to leave behind any trace of your handiwork, especially the dead kind. Now pick up the body and hide it somewhere. Dumping bodies. You can hide dead and unconscious enemies in certain places. Doing so will help you avoid detection by other enemies. You know, there's three people watching. Yeah, I think there's, yeah, that's what it says. May as well. So we'll go about a few views. I think everyone started to play it themselves now. Right, no, we want to... How do we dump here? Okay. Now try to take him down in one slick move. No worries. Try again. Okay. Now try to take him down in one slick move. Come on, you got this. Okay. Now try to take him down in one slick move. No worries. Try again. Phase four got a system update. Um, I don't understand what I'm meant to be okay. doing here. Now try to take him down in one slick move. No worries. Try again. Now, try to take him down in one slick move. Ready to try hacking some gonks in real time? Have fun! More complex scenarios. More advanced quick hacks allow you to use environment or enemies to your advantage. While in control of a camera or turret, you can still quick hack other devices and enemies. Hold tab and aim at one of the guards.
Well, what's this? Um, breach protocol. To upload the ice pick daemon, you must recreate its code sequence by selecting characters from a code matrix. Characters you select will be visible in the buffer. Breach protocol always begins with the first row active. Select 55 from the code matrix. Selecting a character from the active row will then activate the column it belongs to. Select 55 from code matrix. The active area alternates between rows and columns. Select BD from the code matrix. Upload a daemon, you must recreate its code sequence in exact order. Select 55. Now, I don't really know what I did there. Um, Brain down and follow orders in true Militech fashion. Under not too shabby, Militech's algorithms put you on a decent run. Got additional modules if you want to hone any other skills. Before you finish up, don't doubt now. But remember, the street's not going to give you any hints or second chances. Need a handwritten invite? Right. So first, let's shape up those stealth skills. When you enter an enemy's line of sight, their alert indicator will begin to fill. Find cover to avoid detection. Find cover, quick. Nice, nice. Now, move slowly towards the exit. Stay out of sight. Stealthy now, V. You ever relive a ninja BD? Just like that. Nova, well done. On to the next area. Oh, I just got that. Security systems. Keep an eye out for security systems such as turrets and surveillance cameras, which can trigger alarms to alert enemies to your position. Now the same thing, only with the camera. Sightseeing? work today 
Just stand on the platform. All right, some advanced combat techniques for dessert. Then we wrap this party up. Time to get down and dirty in close quarter combat. Take him down, but careful. Looks tough. <laughs> Almost, almost. Again, from the top. No worries. Try again. Enemies at a much higher level than you, marked with a red skull icon, are able to free themselves from your grapple more easily. Defeating them is extremely difficult, so proceed with caution. Okay, that'll do. Now maybe we find someone closer to your weight class. Left mouse to perform a fast attack. Form a fast attack combo, press left mouse while the previous fast attack is being executed. Hold left mouse to change to uh, to charge a strong attack, then release to perform it. Continuously attacking your enemy will drain your stamina. Fast attacks and strong attacks have different stamina costs. Your current stamina is displayed as a yellow bar at the top of your HUD. Your enemy is in a blocking stance, striking to see how your attacks affect him. Let's bump things up from easy to normal. This next fool can block your attacks. Fast attacks will not damage a blocking enemy, only strong attacks can break their stance. Dull bit coming up now. Blocking blows instead of dealing. Stamina cost for blocking. When you are hit while blocking, the attack will consume part of your stamina. If your stamina drops to zero, your blocking stance will break. Your enemy's strong attacks can break your blocking stance in the same way your strong attacks can break theirs. Block just at the right time, you do like a perfect parry. There we go. Got him. Uh, counter attack, yeah, counter attack, parry. Um, to counter an incoming attack, press right mouse to block just before getting hit to deflect the attack and automatically deal the enemy a counter blow. Now, this fool loses his footing every time he swings. Use that. Get in there and land a counter punch. Double tap W, S, A, and D to dodge in the direction you wish. Ooh, I like that. B, want to see this fool punch an air net. Don't let him land. It. Use all the techniques you've learned so far to defeat the enemy. You've done well in mastering the way of the fool, young apprentice. I can teach you no more.
This is the part where you face your final test. Let's move on to melee weapons. Grab a sword. Melee combat techniques you've learned can also be used with melee weapons such as a katana. Good. Now show me what you've learned. Final test. You are equipped with a range of weapons and a cyber deck. You will now face a mix of enemies whom you already encountered in training. Defeat them however you choose. A lot of combat. Combat's good. Good luck, V. Nice. There we go. That's the basics. No doubt I'll forget them in two minutes' time. Now we can get down to biz. Will Kako give you any tips and tricks for the job? I'm not your mother. Just do what I pay you for. It's easy work. Yeah. Let's do this. Elevator. This way. Targets Sandra Dorset. Targets Biomon went mute a couple hours back. Suspected abduction. Target could have possibly flatlined already. Not sure you're in time. We're in time, Bug. We. Sure you're on phones, but that don't make you any less part of this squad. Squad. Charming. Bug. Could at least try to be nice. You want nice, supportive? Call the damn helpline. <laughs> Dorset's protected under Echelon 2 Corpo immunity. Our girl's top shelf. This one's packing black market Zeta Tech repros. Typical back alley fix ups. Not our lucky gal. Let's keep looking. Oh. <laughs> 
not need it. Dorset's protected under Echelon 2 Corpo immunity. Mira, eyes up. The devil's ahead. Quiet me. There we go. Are you up?
Got a lot of good stuff. Hand from Zeta Tech. Uses bio signature, but we ordered a jailbreak. Militech lock on sites. Wonder where this gonk got it. Arisaka hormone regular, no bio signature, and some other little curiosities. Optics actuator and cosmetic real skin. Target. We make it? She alive? About to find out. V, jack into our biomon. Need to know what we're dealing with. <sighs> this does not look good. She's in a tub of ice, crammed in with another. Fuck. Like slaps of meat. Keep it together, V. If she survives, she won't remember a thing. Tiny scar on the subconscious, that's all. Heard people who live through shit like this get panic attacks without ever knowing why. You'll be sipping a glass of ice cold water. Suddenly, your hands shake it. V, Jack, into her biomon. We need to know what we're dealing with. Jacking in. Sandra Dorset, NC570442. Trauma Team Platinum. Platinum? Shit. Trauma should have swooped in if she sneezed. Guessing they jammed the transmitter, Sig. Looking at a hacked biomon, firmware reconfig, or a neurovirus. Carajo, T-Bug. You ain't seeing this place. This is tubs, ice, hooks, and cleavers. Hmm. Scott Muncher's hack, huh? Got an idea. Check her neurocord. Find a shard? Yeah, pull it. That'll be what's muting the biomon. Is that even safe? Can't we just get her out of here? We found her still breathing. Can't lose her. We need that biomon working. Checking for hemorrhages, whatever. Find that shard and yank it. Found the shard. Removing now. Check the biomon. Anything changed? Greetings, Sandra. If you are conscious, assume recovery position now. An emergency evacuation unit has been dispatched and is due to arrive at your location in 180 seconds. Biomon Clave's trauma will be here in three minutes. Your premium plan will cover 90% of the projected costs of your rescue and treatment. Ay, pobrecita. Let's get her off that ice. Jack, look sharp. Not done yet. Don't know who's out there. Locked and ready, V. Do your thing. Oh, fuck! She's flatlining! Need to know what's going Jackie, on. Jackie, air hypo. Fuck, this is bad. Catch, Chica! I think... Holy shit, it worked! Fuera, Chica. Get her outside. Fuera, get her out. Terrace.
five steps back. Now. TT-133 to control. Patient NC-57042 secure. Stimulants being administered. 70 milligrams dopamine. 110 norepinephrine. 800 for brinogen. this thing. Mind if I borrow your wheels? Huh. I got a day with Misty, but I can't take the bed so they're gonna look for me. Won't leave you hanging, Jack. But don't get used to it. You're saving my ass, V. Thank you. How about I drive you home, huh? She's all yours. I'm beat as it is. Almost forgot. Should get Wakako in the hollow. Tell her the job's done. <clears throat> v, how did it go? Our client is alive and well. Not relatively well. Trauma team took her off our hands. She'll recover. Splendid. Your payment awaits you. Ready to come and grab whenever you like, even right away. But I guess home is the only place you wish to be now. The NCPD has surrounded Watson. The district is closed. If you're to make it past the cordon, you must move fast. Thanks for the heads up. Swing by to see you later. Word's doubt the NCPD is gonna put Watson on lockdown. I'm gonna sleep in my own bed tonight. We better put it in fifth. Leave it to me, Chica. I'm driving. Legends are born here. Get up in your brain. Sending your train, sending you. Scully in the gullies, yeah. Bully in the burrows, oh. Starving, yo. Let's grab a tight bite. What do you say? Jackie, they're locking down Watson, remember? Oh, shit. Right. What's this? Vehicle combat. Draw weapon. Alt. Holster weapon and return to seat. Double tap alt. As a passenger, drawing a weapon allows you to lean out the window and use your entire arsenal of equipped ranged weapons. Okay, I can wait. 
Let's just focus on getting home. Somebody with a heart of gold can understand just how much I need to get back to my girl. Your girl? Uh huh. I'm gonna be worried sick if I don't show. I mean, I'm trying to be a stand up guy. He's giving me a chance. Wait. Mm, that's a shame. Look at him. No model citizen, maybe, but he's a good kid. Let them through. But they're the last. Okay, on your way. You have a good evening now, officer, ma'am. She took a liking to you, huh? The devotion I demonstrated grabbed her by the gun. Right. I'm loyal. Stable in my affections. Mm-hmm. And unassuming. You get it. This is censored. You saw a version, you saw her boobs. Yeah, I've got um I've got streamer mode enabled basically. Oh yeah, no no nudity or copyright music. If you're riding as a passenger, you can press F to skip the ride and arrive immediately at your destination. That's handy to know. What about you? I don't like way to make it back to Hayward. Kill me? They'll let me through. Sure about that? Oh yeah. I said hi. I will. Ahí luego. Leveled up. Nice. But I saw something there. No. That was an inventory. One attribute point, and we also have one perk point. How do we do use our perks? Oh, open perks, okay. Something tells me that the crafting and engineering and the intelligence are going to be important. I might go technical ability, let's. As you craft rare items, gain more components when disassembling, scrap out junk items are automatically disassembled. Get that one. Hey, 
how do we use our... Oh yeah, we did it that way. I see, I see, I see, I see. Grabbing up to level 5 as well. Weapons have stat points and everything, that's pretty cool. Um, so it actually does more DPS. Five little mods. Got short circuit, non lethal, deals moderate damage to the target, very effective against drones, mechs, robots, and targets with a weak spot. Reboot optics. There's Night City, it's actually quite a big map. Oh, what happened? I was looking at that. Like a pretty big map. Wasteland's down there, I think, or up around here somewhere. We'll venture out at some stage and see how big it is exactly. Jobs are in there. So I want to see. Can we save it? We can. We'll just save it quickly. Task Tebek has given you his important step into developing your character or something or rather like that.
this relic gives eternal life. But all... Your stash is a secure system for storing equipment and can be accessed from all of your available safe houses and vehicles. For example, if you store something in your car trunk, you'll be able to access it from one of your safe houses. Does zero DPS? What's the point of that? There you go, 164 DPS. Increase evasion by two. Point nine. Oh, we've got new shoes, have we? There's a lot going on at the moment. I'm just sort of trying to figure it all out. What's Okay, so you can upgrade your items too, cool. But not yet. Blocked insufficient co components.
your beauty sleep? <laughs> no matter. Time you got up. I think I might have caught something. When I jacked into that Corpo's biomon. I know a neurovirus or... I need to see Vic. Let him tell me what's got my head reeling and my stomach churning. Okay, let me take you. I brought you a ride. Throw in some threads, meet me downstairs. The Ripper Dock. Alright, I'm actually going to save it up here, guys, because I need to go out and do a couple of things um, before the end of the day. So, thank you everyone who tuned on in today to this live stream. It's actually been a pretty good one. Um, yeah, we've had a few views, a few likes. Thank you everyone for all the likes and that kind of stuff. Um, hopefully, more than likely, I'll be back again tonight with uh, um, part two of uh, yeah, the Cyberpunk playthrough. So, yeah, hope to see you all then. Like I said, thank you everyone. Um, yeah, thank you everyone for all the support. Big shout out to Dragon's Butterfly for the ten dollar dono too. Thank you so much for that. Really appreciate that. Really helps me out. Um, but yeah, and everyone else, thank you everyone else for all the all the um, yeah all the help. But until the next one, guys, stay safe, and I'll see you all again very soon. Boulder bum out. Bye, guys.